Oh, look who's here. It's a cute little kitten who lives in a tree. Time for a ride in your basket. Cue the balloons. Ah, flying. It's the only way to travel. The tree kitten has landed. Now let's bundle you up like a little burrito. Let's clean you up. We should start with those ears. This calls for heavy duty stuff. Good thing we've got a fingertip toothbrush. Really get in those whiskers and scrub those messy paws. Almost done. You can dry off and cosplay as a bunny at the same time. <laughs> Meanwhile, we've got a special surprise for you. Huh? Put some holes in this milk carton and add some udders on top. Now it's like he's got his own personal cow. But around here, we go all out for snack time. We've got food, we've got water, we've got buttons. And the piece de resistance, the meat bar. Of course, you might be in the mood for sausages. Who said cats don't like dogs? Especially hot dogs. Now it's time to have some fun with this long tunnel. Add them to some cardboard boxes. Now our tree kitten has his very own tunnel system. After all, why should hamsters have all the fun? Let's add a little personalization while we're at it. There's no doubt what furry friend lives here. Anyone in the mood for tiny billiards? He'll write the great kitty novel on this. What else? Here's an idea. Grab an old t-shirt. Tie up the ends and hang it up. It's a kitty hammock. Throw on some pillows. Now grab a rubber glove. You only need one. Add it around a cup and fill it up with sand. It's great if you want a tiny chair or a moderate-sized hand. Add a reminder of his favorite person and it's time to explore. I told you he liked her. He plays pool by his own rules. Ah, such a bright sunny day for napping. Hey, be careful on top of that. Even if you can land on your feet. Let's have fun with these paw prints. Add epoxy resin. Decorate any way you want and then add them on a chain. It's a friendship bracelet. Well, a necklace at his size. I've heard of a monkey on your shoulder, but this is better. Run some string through a shower glove's fingertips. Our kitty's not the only one with retractable claws. Now we need to blow up a balloon. Well, that works. Make four of these and tie to each of the strings. It's like a baby mobile and a cat toy rolled in one. Cut up some foam around and cardboard. It's a tiny sink, complete with a tiny mirror. We can even cut up a straw to make a faucet. Add a dial. And what's a bathroom without a bath? A uh, gesundheit. Uh -oh. Is that rain tinsel? How'd that get up there? Hmm, 
This tub could use some tinsel and pom-poms. <laughs> After all, cats don't really do water. What the? I don't think your dolls will miss this garland. Time to see if our kitten likes his new water closet. Probably should powder his nose while we're here. Next up, take a sock and put it on a glass. Fill it up with some soil and seeds. And then, some more soil. We'll need to speed things up a bit. Wrap it up and add googly eyes. Why not? Now that you know how to make it, you'll never run out of delicious cat grass. This cat house needs a doorway. Now take the bristles off some toothbrushes and add it to the door. Grooming now just takes a few steps. Time to get out an old plastic bottle. Cut off the end. Now add some hot glue in the middle. Reattach with some string and pull out the neck. Now take a ball and attach with some more hot glue. Just pull it down and it pops open. Now add kibble. And behold, your cat can have treats with the flick of a paw. Why not make one for yourself while you're at it? It's the best of both worlds. Your kitty gets a ball to play with and snacks. Mmm, chips. Eh, never mind, at least we got the two. Tie some jute rope around it. Lasso it up. Add a bunch to the side of one of the boxes. Now your little rock climber can get some exercise. It's also a fun way of going up without stairs. And it's the perfect place for just hanging around. This cute tiny candy ball's the perfect thing for our cute tiny cat. Got something in your throat? Ooh, a fish skeleton. Dip it in some paint and decorate the cat's house. That, or just make some fish bone broth. Seaweed in her hair? What, is she a mermaid? Well, it's fish related, so on the box it goes. So tell me, kitty, do you like your new pad? You can just relax and scratch an itch, or go on a little adventure. After all, you're the king of this castle. Who knew that hallways could be so fun? Oh no, he thinks I'm a mouse. Why did I eat all that cheese? He'll be in his equally adorable kitty trailer. Ah, just kidding. This kitty's a real professional. Meow, amazing stuff. Catch you next time. Instant cats. Just add water. <laughs> and they say cats don't like water. <laughs> Let's just sneak on by. Huh? Nothing to see. Home free. Oh, coochie coo. <laughs> this is going to be a great day. Oh, I jinxed it. Hmm. This bed could use a makeover anyway. <laughs> Remove this wood. Mm -hmm. Add a panel to the side. Oh, anyone getting dizzy? A fresh coat of paint fixes up everything. All three walls. Let's see what we can do for the outside. A stencil pattern. Let's spread on some paint. Who says we need a brush? Besides, this is much faster. Peel off. On second thought, a brush can take care of the little details. 
Look, a cat face. As if you didn't guess who this was for. Hmm, this hole looks scratchy. And not the kind cats like. This cat door will help make an easy entrance. And with the help of these toothbrushes, the cats will get the scratches they like. Let's take a quick tour, shall we? This grass carpet will please the wild cat inside your pet. What else can we add? Hmm, an old pizza box? Cover with tape, and you can make a few steps. Steps right to the cat's own private bathroom. Meet the new and improved litter box. Now, what else do cats like? How about this? Take some rope and twist it around a base. Tie it so it's nice and tight. And your cat has a new scratching post. What else? Maybe they'll like that pigeon. Oh, even better. Take a desk drawer, add pillows, cushions and some toys, and it's a brand new bed. Here's something we can add to the wall. Now your cats have their own private television. Oh, it's getting hot in here. You know, the cats might want a drink. So, let's give them their own fountain. After all, it's easy to get hot when you can't take off your fur coat. Always smart to try things out before trying on the cats. Now that they have water, they might want something to nibble on too. And we're going all natural with cat grass. And there's plenty of room for a bowl full of cat chow. But let's keep the fridge stocked with wet food, just in case. Everything's really coming together. Let's add some more toys. Well, he's off to Wonderland. What's down there anyway? Ooh, candy. Oh, this bowl should fill up the hole. It's the perfect place for some cat toys. And if the cats are feeling a bit hungry at playtime, this toy's the perfect thing. Just add food. See, they'll get a treat when they spin it around. That'll keep them active. <laughs> hey, can we borrow this pillow? Now take some tights and cut them up. We need an X shape with some material in the middle. Tie each of the two opposite ends together. It's like a bed and swing all in one. Let's test it out. You know, these buttons can help get their point across. They can tell us when they want water, food, or even playtime. It's a bit too small to be a staircase. But we can still use the base. Attached to the wall, and we've got stairs after all. Hey, you're not using this giant bucket, are you? <gasps> Thanks! Huh? Now that we've cleaned it out, we'll cut out an opening. Huh, what else do we need? How about more toys? You can never have enough cat toys. And we can use them for a project. Hot glue them to the patch from earlier. You remember from the hole? Add them to the bottom of our can for a soft cushion. Now break out the power tools. We're drilling some holes. After making a few, run some thread through them. It's kind of like a checkerboard pattern. The cats are gonna be so happy. Where are they anyway? 
I uh, think you've got a little something there. Oh, that gives me an idea. Add hot glue, press it down, and it's as good as laminated. Perfect for keychains or personalized collars. <laughs> this cat toy's interactive. Let's add it to our collection. <laughs> Cats sure have good taste. This looks fun. <laughs> cat food? Maybe we should leave some things to the cats. Oh, it's just a toy. Huh? And we've got the perfect place for it. You know, it's a little small. We need to think bigger. <gasps> Let's get a large glass container filled with water. Fill with stones and marbles. Add a plant. And the finishing touch, these cute little fish. <laughs> I spy with my little eye, well, her eye, eyes, a plastic bottle. Empty it and cut it up. Take the bottom and hot glue some string in the middle. Now use the string to reattach the two pieces. Add a pom-pom to the top and fill with cat chow. Hang it up. More snacks? These are gonna be some lucky cats. Cool, a laser for our cats to catch. Let's try it out. Either it's the laser, or she needs to clean her pores. Huh? Hmm. Hard to catch, just what we need. <sighs> What's on your head? It's like a fidget spinner. Let's add to the wall. <laughs> what can't be improved with the addition of stickers? These pictures will help give it a more homey feel. Some more toys. Cats sure know how to live. Maybe we can put this tablecloth to better use. As the curtains for our brand new cat hangout. Yeah, this is where all the cool cats come to play. Great place for a nap. You gotta for a big day of sleeping. Still, look at all the fun stuff to do. Eat grass. Use stuffed animals as a floor. Or just relax. Looks like someone's ready to play too. Or maybe just stretch. You gotta love all the accommodations. And there's still so much more to explore. Who needs steps when you have a giant scratching post to climb? Unwind, watch a little TV, have a drink. Oh no, mm -hmm. he's found the cats. I mean, what cats? Huh? Aw, it's love at first sight. meow horrific stuff. Catch you next time. Oh, there's nothing sadder than a cat person without a cat. Luckily, it looks like that's about to change. Oh, it's a kitty. And she's so fluffy. Something tells me that's not rain. Whatever it is, it's coming with a chance of kittens. Ooh, are you having a tom or a queen? Two of each? Mommies in the making need lots of love and attention. Especially when they start shedding. Don't worry, our cat brush will fix you right up. This'll catch all that excess hair. And disposal couldn't be easier. Who wants a paw rub? Let's tuck you in and count some white mice. 
Huh, this curtain just sparks inspiration. From table to fort, a cat fort. Complete with a big fluffy teddy bear. Bring those two bear paws together. And keep them that way. Add a cushion. It's your own little chair in your own little corner. Wow, construction's thirsty work, you know. No, but save some water. It's just what our toilet water dish needs. So fresh and clean, you'll want a sip for yourself. Don't forget some TP, always comes in handy. After all, accidents do happen. Some kibble will pair great with all this water. Oh, there's a prize. Oh, we found Nemo. Of course, every fish needs a bowl. Why not add a little island in the middle? Just add water, too. Now it's all ready for our robot fish. Round and round they go. Ooh, careful! Oh, I think you broke that brush. No matter, those bristles look all right. Just add some glue and it's a new scratching post. Wow, you sure go through a lot of brushes. <laughs> Ugh, we need to get a litter box in here. In the meantime, Ew. it's time for a little 52 pickup. Ew. Looks like she's got an idea. And just in time, too. Start by cutting a little door on the side. Hmm. Maybe something in this old Christmas box will help. No, not this. Not that. Aha! Our tiny Christmas tree. I knew it wasn't such a bad little tree after all. In fact, we'll need a few to cover up the sides. Just lay out the green carpet and a plastic bag. Don't forget to glue it all together. Add some sand, like every litter box needs. <laughs> uh, gravity is just not your friend today. But cardboard is far more agreeable. You can make it into all sorts of new things. All it needs is some old Christmas lights. And why not add a pillow at the bottom? I think your bird shedding <laughs> must be catching. Eh, loose feathers means crafting supplies. Add this to a string and add some beads. Let's hang these up like a beaded curtain. And it's the perfect place for all your old gum. We should add a pillow on top. Look, there's even a door! <laughs> we'll need stairs, unless cats can fly. Ooh, nice pom-pom. Can we borrow it? A few of these will brighten up the doorway. Oh, I think Kitty wants to help. Uh, maybe not. Either way, this broom is just what we needed. Take an empty box and fill it up with a bunch of bristles. Pour a little cement on the bottom, not too much. We want those bristles sticking out so Kitty can play with them. 
Uh-oh. Hope we didn't use up all our brooms. Hey, there's something in the plant pot. Oh, it helps you make paw prints. And we've got plenty of paws. This is going right in our collage. Ooh, beach balls on tap. Now that's fancy. But let's not forget about all that string either. Wrap it around and glue it into place. Now all we need is something to stand it on. And something sharp. Don't worry, I said we've got them on tap. Cut an opening. It'll help get the ball out. And your kitty cat in. Wow, someone tell that ostrich we found her egg. It looks like it's ready to hatch. Let's help. Ooh, confetti. And a cute baby duck. Sure had a lot of room in there. Looks like someone's got a new best friend. Meanwhile, let's have fun with all this laundry. These green tights are just what we needed. Start by folding one into the other. And tie them to these chair legs. You've got a little hammock right in your room. So who wants to try it out? Any takers? What happened to our feline friend? Well, at least we've got a sock. So many holes. Let's make some more. Take these tubes and add frills toward the end. <laughs> Accessorize and your kitty friend's got a brand new outfit. Put your paw through and you're photo ready. Perfect time for a snack break. But first, let's have some fun with the container. We really just need the bottom. It works even better than tracing paper. Draw the outline and then color it in. When you're finished, cut it out. Leave some room to punch a hole in at the top. Now we just need to add some heat. This will shrink things down to size. It's the right size for our new necklace. All dressed up for a nice night at home. <laughs> Your brand new cat home. Let's explore. Wow, those cats know how to live. Guess somebody's got some cat scratch fever. Now that's a bear hug. Time to descend the stairs like you just had a makeover. And there's so many places to catnap. But I think this is her favorite spot. <laughs> Remember to order that big liter of milk and a 20-pound salmon. Good. Now, does the cat want anything? Pretty cool stuff. Catch you next time. Thumpkins mm. getting a place on the Walk of Fame. Talk about losing face. Hey, wait a minute. It's our brand new toy. And he sure is squishy. Time to blow out your candles. Make a wish. <laughs> I've heard of putting your foot into a recipe. Oh, I see. For once, I'm glad the cake was a lie. Wow, a green foot. Ooh. A few more molds uh -huh. and we'll have our own Shrek. Ew. But for now, it's our brand new candle. Now we get five wishes. I think. Huh? 
Keep pushing, keep pushing. Oh, if only you'd aimed a little lower. Well, for next time. Take out your 3D pen and draw some lines. White and red? Huh, reminds me of something. Wow, it's like toothpaste mm -hmm. inception. I'm just glad it didn't get stuck in the second tube. Uh. Oh, hot chocolate. Uh, you should have used a coaster. Hmm, some foil makes for a makeshift bottom. And why not a leg or four to stand on? Oh, a trunk and ears. It's an elephant. This pachyderm's gonna be pretty in pink. Pour in something to drink and enjoy. And look, the trunk's a handle. And the ears are ears. Starting to see the family resemblance. Uh, careful. No. Oh, well. So, who wants omelets? Frittatas? Mm -hmm. Maybe we should make some egg cups. Even better, some legs to stand on. <laughs> and you don't have to stop at just chickens. Now you can have a real egg zoo. Pizza's here. Uh, probably shouldn't have said that. Well, we can whip something up. And you don't even need to step into the kitchen. Just melt some candy with your 3D pen. And you've got your own slice of candy pizza. You know, food just tastes better on a stick. Pretty sweet stuff. Catch you next time. Oh, what adventures can we have with this 3D pen? Let's look. Marvelous. This guy's just begging for our help. Even ripped pants are no match for a 3D pen. Ah, noodles. The answer to all of life's problems. And there's even a prize inside. A phone. Maybe there's a way to combine our two loves. All these squiggles make it look like Top Ramen. Mmm, fried eggs, fish cakes, and even green onion. Let's add a fork and go back to enjoying the real thing. <laughs> and hey, don't forget about our bonus episode at the end of the video. We'll make a real diamond with a 3D pen. <laughs> Nature is all fun and games until you remember that's where bugs live. Run! I'd reach for bug repellent, but let's see what she draws up. Let's start with triangles within triangles. Wow, it's starting to look like a little catapult. Time to bring out our secret weapon. for your lives! It's raining deliciousness! Yes. And she's got plenty of ammo. She must buy cereal in bulk. Barbie here needs a good home. And maybe a spa day. You know what this means? Makeover time. Let's start with the hair. And a new outfit. Honestly, we could draw up a whole wardrobe.
She needs a haircut. She's not <laughs> Rapunzel, Barbie. Nothing like a whole new look to help you take on the world. It's not a good day when your bubble wand betrays you. What a great idea! We can draw our own bubbles! Or maybe draw a new wand. Yeah, that makes more sense. Really taking this whole wand thing seriously. There's a star and everything. Wow. Good idea. More circles means more bubbles. And it works. Have you ever seen bubbles this big? SpongeBob would be proud. And this is why you should always take the sidewalk. Aw, don't cry. <laughs> the rip look might come back in style. Mm -hmm. Besides, why get upset when you can get creative? Kinda looks like a spider web so far. And why not? Spiders are the original weavers. <laughs> Great, now we have to draw a brand new watermelon. Oh, wait a minute. On second thought, this saves us the trouble of cutting it up. She's not planning on eating it, is she? First off, she's drawing a pattern around the rind and adding a rim. Fill in the lines, and you've got a hat. Why not keep the melon theme going? It's cute and all, but is anyone gonna eat that melon? No. Ah, a fun day at the park with the wind in your hair. A lot of wind. Ah, uh, maybe too much wind. I don't think you can fix your hair with a shovel. You know, with a few changes, this shovel becomes a brand new brush. That's much better. And look, it even collects hair like a real brush. So you know it works. And this, kids, is why it's always a good idea to pick up your oh. toys. Or you'll really lose your marbles. Besides, cleanup can be fun. Fill up this pop-up toy with marbles. But now, run your 3D pen over them. and you'll have a brand new case. And altogether, it helps give you a nice massage. Hey, time to get up. It's almost party time. <sighs> Probably should do something with your hair. Is there time to pin your ears back?
Let's add some style to these hair clips. Well, this is a new spin on hair extensions. Now boogie down. Do you want a napkin? Maybe a few wet wipes? Hmm. Well, when it's all gone, we can have fun with the container. After all, this is the fun of recycling. Cover the shape of the lid and then place a stick through it. And soon, you'll have a brand new top. Now it's time for our long-awaited bonus episode. She's in for a big surprise. And so is he. Huh? And this is why you get things insured, people. Luckily, we can draw up a new ring, complete with a new jewel. Just change the subject if she asks about carrots. Hey. What a happy yes. ending. Oh no! Granny's glasses are broken! Now how will she read? I mean, she could always just rent some audiobooks. Oh, never mind. Once again, it's the 3D pen to the rescue. We drew a whole new pair. No lenses, but at least she'll look smart. Hey, so are there any leftover noodles? I'm asking for a friend. Catch you next time. Happy birthday. Oh, and look, this one's got air holes. It's a puppy. Oh, a toy puppy. <laughs> kind of a misleading box. Well, we can still play with it. Let's give it a bath. Sweet Jiminy Crickets! Your love made it a real dog! Thank you, Blue Fairy, wherever you are. Maybe we should wait before we break it to Mom. Just a few seconds old, and he's already got bugs. Time to break out the tweezers. Wow, some of these bugs are big enough for a hands-on approach. Ew, someone's got dog breath. Well, don't worry, we've got a brush just for you. Canines are pretty important to canines. Maybe that's how they got the name. Now let's clean up the whole row. Huh, what have you been eating? Now it's time for the other kind of brush. Oh, soon enough, we'll have enough to make a new dog. Quick, let's hide you. If anyone asks, you're a pile of clothes. Just stay still. Did you have a nice birthday, honey? What the? Oh, she's just shedding and then dyeing the hair. Wow, I can't believe that worked. Ew. Sort of. Either way, it's time for a little spring cleaning. Let's pile it up. Now where's a carpet to sweep it under? Ooh, your pants could use a good swipe too. Wow, the puppy's really good at hiding. Seriously. Oh, this isn't good. Let's follow that trail of chewed up clothes. Well, dogs like to dig, and dig they shall. Come on, we need to clean those dirty paws. This device should help. It's a shower and a brush all in one.
What a good dog. Most would have had five escape attempts by now. Let's dry you off. Well, that's one way. But let's try this bathrobe. And if mom asks, you're a shark. And for being such a good boy, you get a face massage. But don't let the name fool you. It can massage more than just your face. I think there's time to have a turn of your own, too. Wait, I'd be careful about taking a nap. Hey. Nothing to see here, just us toys. Uh-huh. Yeah, mom needs to check those glasses. Now what did we say about naps right now? I'm sure we can sew them back up. But for now, let's trim those nails. Okay, that didn't work. Time for plan B. Ah, plastic wrap. Now it's a plastic cap. Some peanut butter should please our furry friend. Now he won't notice the mani-pedi. Hey, where are you going? Why couldn't mom fill up on birthday cake like the rest of us? What? You forgot the ketchup. Well, someone doesn't mind. At least you still got your ketchup. Silly doggy thinks he's people. Here's something for you. A kibble dispenser. It's dinner time with the press of a button. Bon appetit. And don't forget, moms have to eat too, you know. What? A living room's like a city to this pupper. Ooh, look at all these boxes. Let's have some fun. We can make a whack-a-mole game, but with treats. Besides, moles bite. Quick, hide, it could be moles. We're in the clear. Time to relax with a good book. Let's see. Wow, that koala sure likes eucalyptus. Aw, why don't you come up for story time? Uh -huh. Hmm, good point. How do you get up? Hmm. Great wow. idea. This doggy staircase should help. Come on, it's easy. Just one step at a time. Hold on a sec. I think nature's calling. Though someone needs to keep an eye on him make that something. This camera should help. Okay, let's try it out. It's all on your phone. Yeah, I never liked those shoes either. Green with green dots? <laughs> he did you a favor. Still, this sniffing mat should distract him. Especially when you add surprises inside. Pockets just make everything a little bit better. Let's try it out. And while he's distracted, hide your shoes. Except toe shoes, they deserve to be chewed up. Ooh, it looks like shoes aren't the only thing on his diet. But don't worry, now it can be his new collar. Don't you look dapper and selfie ready. This one would make a great ID tag. The glue gun's the perfect laminator. Just cover it with wax paper and flatten it with a rolling pin. Oh, don't you look dapper, doggy. What other looks would you like to try out? Well, you heard the answer button. 
A dragon costume? Look, spikes! Okay then. How about a superhero? We'll just call him Crypto. Uh -huh. Is it a bird? A plane? It's Super Dog! Wow, it's like he really can fly! Well, that was a great workout for both of us. Photo time! The Daily Planet will pay big for this. Ooh, look, an ink pad! Any takers? That's one way to get your John Hancock. Wow, this one's going right on the wall! But here's another way to help him express himself. Add some paint and a clear cover to a canvas. Some dog food on top should help too. Who needs a paintbrush when you've got a nose for art? You know, wall art's a step above refrigerator mm. art. Wait, you shouldn't play with paint. Besides, what you need is a chew toy. And look, it's corn-themed. Smear some food on the kernels. Now this is what you should sink your teeth into. Ooh, look at the mess. There are paw prints everywhere. Okay, actually, I kind of like it, but that's just me. Oh no! It's worse than I feared! She's got contacts! Now she'll get you, and your little dog, too! A suitcase? Is she sending you packing? Wait a minute, she's making it a doggy bed! It's the best seat in the house. I mean, look, it's portable. <laughs> We've had a lot of fun today wishing toys to life. But be careful. Side effects can include a dog growing 10 feet tall or turning fire engine red. Do not feed after midnight. Consult local gnome for any additional questions or comments. woof a stuff! Catch you next time! Hello, Mr. Strawberry! Are you ready for your facial? Ooh, it looks like a beard transplant. Well, he always wanted to be one of those cool shaven cans. When it comes to peas, you don't need a whole pod. You can have tons of fun with just one. Hey, that rhymes. But what's really fun to play with is a balloon. Blow it up. You know, we can use it to make a pea pod too. Let's start out by making three. Now tape them together. For extra fun, let's draw some faces on them. Hey, mice faces are still faces. Now give it a good squeeze. All the cats are coming out for this. What a pretty dolly. Let's give her a haircut. I was thinking a pixie cut, but bald is beautiful. Now let's trim some whiskers. Wait, hold on. We can whip you up a new weave. Be careful, you might feel a slight pinch. Ooh, who says blondes have more fun? Sometimes you just gotta think pink. Mm, cherry flavored. A plastic cup with nothing inside. What a waste of a good cup. So let's have some fun. Draw something on it. It's a tiny pair of shades. And look, they come in your size. Who says hole punches can only come hole shaped? 
Especially when you can get the gold star, among other prizes. Let's see how he looks with a few beauty marks. But why not save some for yourself, too? Enjoy your catnap? Surprise! We've never looked better. And cats already look good, thanks to all that beauty sleep. As every cat knows, it's kind of hard to top a ball of yarn. But we're always up for a challenge. Let's add it inside a balloon. What else? Ooh, glitter. And some clear glue. Ooh, it's nice and squishy. What else can we try? Ooh, ice cream. It's got a nice smile, but let's give it a bigger mouth. Oh, it's nice and hollow. So let's squeeze our squishy ball inside. When it's ready, give it a good squeeze. Just because that one cat wore a hat doesn't mean they all do. All cats have their own sense of style. Some prefer to sparkle and shine. And also wear wigs. And don't you worry, there's plenty of sparkle to go around. Oh no! Cola is a terrible thing to waste! Careful, you don't want any sticky paws. Don't worry, just blow up a balloon. And deflate it into a brand new glove. You could just lap it up, but cats prefer milk. Hmm, you sure that bowl's big enough? Then again, you can't beat drinking straight from the source. We might not have the whole cow, so we'll settle for the others. Bubbles are so fleeting, so let's make a bunch. Here's an idea. Take a bottle and a straw. No, we're not blowing bubbles in chocolate milk. Especially since we're cutting them up. Place pieces of straw inside the bottle top. Use a rubber band to attach it to an electric fan. Now just give it a dip in some bubble solution. Time to turn on your DIY bubble machine. Ah, the artist at work. Let's add some red, yellow, blue. It's SpongeBob. I knew that cat had good taste. Time for Sponge to meet Squeegee. Gotta love that underwater work. Our little archaeologist is hard at work searching for treasure. Just add a little water, not too much. Now time to air dry. Time for some elbow grease. I think cats have elbows, right? A running mouse? Let's see if it lives up to its name. Oh, look at it go. No wonder it's so much fun chasing him. I'm starting to understand where the term cat burglar came from. Just what is our furry little friend up to? Ooh, a balloon. I guess he likes it on the frosty side. It's like a pinata. Just scratch it open and collect your prizes. Congratulations! Huh? 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 
Careful, you might chip a tooth. Oh, now where's that blow dryer? Oh, even better, a hammer. It's time for a little smashing. Make that a lot of smashing. Careful, you don't want to break your stuff. What a good idea. We've still got ice left over. After all, I am feeling a little parched. Time to do a little gardening. Look at that cucumber. Let's clean it up. Keep it lined up. We're gonna start slicing. Or would you prefer to pickle it first? We're only cutting partway through for now. Flip it over so we can cut the bottom half. Why not? Keeps the board scratch free. Careful, we're not cutting all the way through, you know. Because it's much more fun to make a spiral. Hey, squash can come in spaghetti. And why should squash have all the fun? Catterific stuff. Catch you next time. This dog's looking for a new BFF. We've got a match. Let's meet up. Mm, wow. Looks like her. <laughs> sort of. Anyway. We found you your new match. So, why don't you come over for a visit? What you waiting for? Come inside. It looks like there's a dress code around here. Now let's try some pimple patches. And look, they come with paw prints. Give it time and the pus peels right off. Uh, you can throw that out now. Wow. Oh, smooth. <laughs> now let's fix those yeah. eyes. We've got just what you need in the freezer. It's an ice lollipop. Just rub under your eyes a few times. Soon you'll look well rested. And it tastes great too. Now let's move on to those teeth. We're gonna need something extra special. Aha! Let's use the new dog toothbrush. Now that's some fresh toothpaste. Open wide. It's time to brush. Now you can taste again. Well, wow. wait 30 minutes. Cool. You know, makeup can really help you express yourself. Okay, that seems about your skin tone. <laughs> Add it on. Uh, let's ask for a second opinion. Why don't we try something else? Now take an egg. Careful, it's fragile. Wow. And cover it up with makeup. Now get blotting. And be careful, you don't want egg on your face. And I'm in the mood for omelets. Speaking of food, you've earned a treat. But it's not for eating, it's for contouring. Just don't forget to blend it in. Ooh, and it smells great too. Why don't you try a makeup pencil next? Remind me not to leave her unsupervised. What you need is a stencil. For now, let's use this coat hanger.
Good wow. job. Let's throw <laughs> confetti. Wait. That's not confetti. Wow. Amazing. It's beetroot. Also money, but also beetroot. Cool. It's practically free lipstick. And blush, too. Ooh. Eh, we should probably blend that in. Everything's looking rosy. Speaking of looking, time for mascara. You say it with your eyes. You know, some thumbs would come in handy. At least these paws are good for wiping. This looks like a job for heavy artillery. Bring out the glue gun and draw out some shapes. Huh, they could still use some color. Good thing we've got a whole makeup rainbow. Blend the colors to give it a nice hue. Why don't you try them on for size? All you have to do is pick one. Wait, where does it go? Here? No, silly, it goes over the eye. Good thing we made a matching pair. Now let's fix up those shoes and socks. Maybe something less Alice in Wonderland. Oh, a band-aid? Inspiration strikes! Let's put it on your nose and add some makeup. Grab your brush. How about a nice green color? Make sure to color outside the lines. Now peel it off and add some stickers. You just can't go wrong with teddy bears. Oh, someone deserves to get pet. Hey, what's wrong? Is it her hand? Ooh, you're going to need a mask. That'll perk up your paws. And look. Just unfold, and it's a cat paw. I think that's called a dew claw. Just kidding. Let's tape it down. Gimme paw. Who's up for some patty cake? <laughs> Okay, that should be enough. Let's see how they look. Oh, it's all so nice and smooth. Except for the rest of the arm. Uh-oh. This calls for special measures. Our special hair remover spray-on cream. Just be careful where you aim that stuff. Oh, that poor doll! But wait, that just means it works! Oh, your arms are oh so smooth! Now for the rest of your hair. Hmm. How about we twist it up? Uh -huh. uh oh, I think it's stuck. Do I need to get the scissors? Wait, those paws know what to do. Just twist the hair on this drying rack. Some clothes pins will keep things in place. Now, let's get the hair dryer. Should be enough. How does it look? Make sure you took off all the clips. Wow! Hair this good, you just got a flip. Time to take on the world. Ouch! At least we won't need makeup remover. Oh, don't 
cry. Your furry friend knows what to do. Grab some stretch wrap. Take out your favorite makeup. And draw a new face on top. Why don't you try it on for size? Make sure to stick it on. Let's see how it looks. Wow! This pup's got your back. And I think someone's getting a walk. Time for dinner. Now how did he get in here? Now that's much better. Let's dig in. Could use some gravy. Mm, what's that smell? Dogs really need to try out the whole litter box idea. Well, this pooper scooper looks like it makes things easy. Good job. Probably should sanitize the couch. Still, it looks like we got this scooper just in time. Just how many dogs do you have again? Look at all that rain. Oh no, that poor puppy. We have to save him, hurry. First things first, let's get you an umbrella. Well, that was easy. Now it's time to get out of this rain. Or go to the park? Well, gotta get in those steps. Good thing there's room enough for two. Uh-oh, and this is why you need to puppy-proof. Either way, you need a bath. But better yet, a shower. Just plug it in, and you get a spritz and a scratch all in one. This puppy will be clean in no time. Every dog's gonna love the sound of that. Come on, a walk? It's such a great day for napping. Well, if we have to go, this cat will show you how to do it. First, let's try this charming cat carrier. Now this is a walk. The kind where you don't actually walk. Always love a nice ride through the country. Rain again? <laughs> Weather's sure weird around here. On the plus side, you don't need a shower tonight. Let's dry you off before things get even wetter. We just need to put you in this snazzy new outfit. Add a blow dryer to the tail and let the drying commence. Now you and your dog can get your hair done together. You should be done by now. Nice and dry. Wow, a retractable lollipop holder. Wonder what the retracting expert thinks. Well, one man's candy is a cat's face scratcher. Uh-oh, look at all those dirty paws. We'll need to start cleaning at the source. This device should help. Just add soap. Just squeeze out the foam and treat those paws. Don't forget to dry when you're done. And clean that couch. Speaking of paws, it's time for a manicure. Time to use your head. Seriously, wrap it up. And cover it up with some wet pet food? Someone isn't gonna mind cleaning it up. Good, a distraction. Now fix those nails. Don't worry, your dog won't feel betrayed. Especially when they learn there's food left over. 
This kitty's ready for a close-up, Mr. DeMille. <laughs> if only cats could have fun costumes to wear. Who said they don't? Just look at this little cap. Release your inner beast. Or maybe get ready for the holidays. Say cheese. I mean, you are wearing mouse ears. Litter boxes seem cleaner, but you still need to clean them. We're gonna need a tool for this. Just don't forget a bag. It'll come in handy. Just scoop things up. Probably should ask the vet about that. Maybe the cat's just hiding its veggies in here. See, I told you that bag would come in handy. Good thing, too. This box won't stay clean for long. Oh, that reminds us. It's time to exercise. Let's get ready. Get the leash, tie those laces, and head out. Really working up a sweat. Come on, no pain, no gain. Oh, it's time for a break. It's important to hydrate. And I meant that for the both of you. Hmm. Luckily, we've got portable doggy bowls. Granted, bowls are usually portable, but not like this. Don't forget the kibble. Your furry friend totally earned it. Good, all gone. Now you can wrap it up. By the looks of it, somebody wants a muffin. Oh. And they're not going down without a fight. If only we could make a muffin tin treat for pups. Well, just fill each hole with kibble and a toy. Ah, tennis balls. You can never go wrong with tennis balls. Some prefer muffin tops, but this dog can't wait to get to the bottom. Now you're free to dig into those backup muffins. Ugh, where's the light switch? Careful not to trip. Don't worry, your pupper is here to help with a shiny new collar. You can customize the size and add as many as you need. And now your dog's ready for the next rave. Turn off the light, and why not join in on the fun, too? Sorry, Cup, but the cat says you gotta go. Actually, pushing things off tables looks like fun. And these cat paws let you join in on the fun. Let's play with some cat toys while we're at it. The best part, use them to play with your cat. Yeah, that's the spot. Oh no, what cat doesn't come when the treats are shaking? Oh, the toilet, of course. The best seat in the house. Reunited, and it feels mm, suffocating, apparently. Let's use this hanger to help. Cut it up. We'll need to do a little bit of bending. Add a little tape to secure these arches in place. Place on a cardboard base. Just poke through. Cover it up so that it's a little tent. Your cat will never want to leave. And look who's up for a game of catch the finger. Looks like you're about to get a wet one. Don't make that a messy one. What have you been feeding this dog? 
We need to do something about this canine's teeth. Luckily, we've got a special doggy toothbrush. Looks like your cat's not the only one to get hairballs. Well, if you really need to lick your cat, this should help. Your cat gets a good brushing and no saliva. Clean up's a breeze. Why not groom yourself while you're at it? Hard to get up when your moonlighting is a chair. But you can't just ghost your own mother. Here's what to do. Grab a pillow and remove the stuffing. Fill up a pair of old jeans you can afford to lose. Keep the legs crossed together. And now, it's time to make the old switcheroo. While we're at it, why not make a whole fake person? Now call your mother. Sensational stuff! Catch you next time. Aw, poor little rich girl. Oh no, what's gonna happen to all her pets? I mean, think of the hamster. All these bristles should make paw cleaning a breeze. And look, it's electric. Just press the button and add water. And just in time, too. Look at those dirty paws. It's like a before and after. Let's fix that. Much better. Wow. But let's try out the homemade version. Ew. It's a cup, but what do we do for bristles? Good idea. Don't forget to add water. And by the looks of it, you'll need to power it yourself. It looks like it works just as well. You'll save quite a bit if you put in some elbow grease. Yes, it's playtime. Bring on the toys. It's like a carrot patch with hidden treasure. Never underestimate a puppy's sense of smell. I sense a pattern. Oh, look under the carrots. Now let's see if we can make our own fun. If you ever wanted to play tic-tac-toe with animals, now you know how. Wait, do you have to eat the treats too? And it looks like we have a winner. And he's such a good sport. Finally, something for the hamsters. Wow, this is like the easiest maze ever. You win, and the prize is hamster snacks. Maybe we can have some fun with this tube too. Ew. Soon we'll have our own little labyrinth. And we can add extensions too. Just keep on eating chips. Speaking of snacks, either way, he's happy with the end result. Next up is a little something special for the cat. Wow! This combines the fun of an avocado with the things cats go nuts for, catnip. Yeah. 
This kitty's gonna sleep well tonight. Now, what can we do with this toilet paper roll? First, cut it up into four pieces. Fold them together into a sphere and add a treat inside. And once again, the game begins. Oh, it's not free. It's priceless. Which one will she choose? I would have picked the one for the hamster. Just think of all the leg room. Being carried around, it's the only way to travel. Now it's time to try this giant mm. tote bag. Yes, never underestimate the power of legroom. Just don't make the holes too big or she'll Aww. escape. Everyone can give your pupper a nice foot rub. Of course, pets need to stay hydrated when you carry them around. And with a few little twists and turns, it becomes a fountain. Maybe we can do the same by cutting it up. Like all our best crafts, it's time to add some fire. Stick in a bottle of water. Loosen the cap and let gravity do its job. Either way, the dogs like it. Scratching posts. Because, like the best of us, cats just know the importance of getting your nails done. Well, it's a good shape, but will it be good for scratching? This yarn should help. After all, it is yarn. And cats kind of have a thing for yarn. Let's just hot glue everything into place. And add a mustache. You know, just to keep things fancy. Good. Those nails are getting quite a workout. With googly eyes and a hat, it's a pretty good deal. But grooming isn't entirely your pet's responsibility. Hmm. These bristles will help clean up your cat's coat. Just in time, too. Ew. With all that hair, we can make a new cat. Yuck. Told ya. Well, hmm. we've got the glove, but what about those bristles? Ah, yes, hot glue. Just remember to let it dry. Well, the cat liked it, but it didn't really do anything. The toy cat can keep this. Now your cat can spend hours trying to catch fish. So after teasing him like this, you owe him a nice tuna dinner. Let's see if we can make our own version of this. Besides just letting your cat near a fish tank. Of course, adding catnip sure helps. Okay. 
And now you've got a Kitty original to hang on the wall. What a deal! Well, when it comes to your cat's litter box, it's usually for the best to splurge. Cats need their privacy after all. I wonder if they synchronize this in advance. Probably should talk to your vet about this. Ew. Yeah, let's not waste a perfectly good sock. Here's a better idea. Let's make our own private litter box. Cool. Just need to make a door in this shelf. And add litter to the bottom. Now a cat can walk in whenever they need to. Though seriously, I'd really ask your vet about your cat and produce. As always, our animal actors were real professionals. Though the human one really could have learned a thing or two from them. Animal amazing stuff, right? Catch you next time. Hey Mario, are you ready for a new adventure? Let's go! A plumber's job is never done. Speaking of plumbing, I guess it's occupied. I think he's gonna be a while. Unless we try out this brand new toilet water bowl. It's nice and fresh. Anyone thirsty? Quick, before a line starts. Cat cops? Ever seen criminal mice? You're welcome. Must be where they keep the best cat toys. I'm sure he'd be happy to lend a paw. Now fill it up with some hot glue. And scrape away all that sand. Only one way to see if it works. Great success! It was the perfect crime. Hey, it's dark in here! Ow! So hard to see. Is that a dog? Maybe the mystery box can help. Look, it's an LED collar. Try it out. And there's more where that came from. Now shine on. Is there any gold around here? Well, that answers that. Yeah, I wouldn't get too close. TP, maybe? Aha! A pooper scooper! Oh, it even comes with bags! Seems simple enough. Scoop it up. And put it where it belongs. You know, I always wondered about those pipes. And that's where gold coins come from. Hey, watch your step, Mario! I'd better think of something before you start seeing claws. Look, it's a dino chomper! Kitty want a lick? Aww, what a nice kitty. Maybe we should change the sign. This dog's bark is worse than his spikes. Stick to head pads. Hey, what's that? 
Ooh, let's pretend we don't see it. Aha! Oh, hey, that's not a mushroom. It's a pet massager. Try it out. Ooh, a hands-free experience. But that box is none the wiser. Oh no! The bricks are coming down! What the? Is anything real in here? Let's hope this pomelo's a different story. Because we could sure use that shell. Now for a little measuring. And a little cutting. Your pup's got a new helmet. Just in time, the sky is falling! Hey, this mushroom's a mess. Actually, the room's a mess. The perpetrator! Ah, don't worry. Here's something that can help. A cat brush. Seems self-explanatory. Grab that cat. And let's get brushing. And look, it even works on paws. Paws! When it's done, it comes clean off. Why don't we collect all this cat hair? Just get crafting, and soon we'll have a brand new pair of kitty flip-flops. Just the thing for a nice stroll. Or just a day of pampering. Now where is that mystery box? Uh-oh, looks like we've got company. Let's try this one instead. It's an interactive treats wheel. Open it up and add the treats. Make sure you close it up. Now just attach it to the wall. You think he'll get it out? Great success! And while no dog's looking, this pug's a mess with stress. Cleaning him up is the easy part, but so is calming him down. With our helpful massage tool. Now for some tummy scratching. These little hands will get in every nook and cranny. And let's finish up with a face mask. Who needs a dryer? Sunshine's free. Of course, outside does have its drawbacks. It's okay. Take a basin and start welding. We need to cut out a little opening. Now add another basin on top. Decorate. And add something soft around the rim. Some litter is the final touch. And Kitty's got a brand new potty. To contain all those little surprises. What has this cat been eating? Good thing those aren't blocks. You should be nice to mushrooms. Or they won't share their coins. This will help a back scratcher. Um, I meant with the dog. <laughs> the dog! That's a good boy. Okay, lift a little more. Eh, we've got time. Keep on scratching. 
Hey, careful with those nails. Oh, your poor overalls. It's infuriating. Great, now the basketball's broken. Wait, we can use it for our next craft. Look, it's a piranha plant. It'll probably need a stem. Here, cover it up with rope. And maybe it can use a tongue. Now Kitty has a brand new scratching post. And a throne right on top. Check out this dog mobile. You've got insurance, right? No matter, we can fix it up. When life gives you lemons. Oh, we can just use this cart. Of course, a new ride should look its best. Don't forget to add some headlights. We're gonna need some engines. And an M for Mario. And streamers. Let's take it out for a spin. Oh, it's Mario powered. Guess we'll save a ton on gas. Come on, the camera loves you. You own that catwalk. Though, maybe I shouldn't have used the word catwalk. Want your pup to be a fashion star? Start with boots. Let's try these first. Aren't they cute? <laughs> Perfect fit. Just remember, we need four in all. It's not like your pup can resist all those puddles. Now let's try the balloon. Deflate it a little. That was quick. Now place on your pupper. And it still protects their paws from all that dirt. Either way, it's cheaper than a doggy treadmill. Of course, while dogs appreciate a good walk, they sometimes prefer to just ride along. Especially when you do the skating for them. Hey, look, Ma, no paws. But if you don't have a special bag, we can try out an old tote bag. Cut out some paw holes. Plop your puppy right inside and go for a spin. Just be careful if you've got a great dame. Time for gadgets for your dog's more private moments. This one's pretty big. And look, it gets bigger. And bags are included. Just take one and wrap it around. Well, we might as well try it out. Give it a sec and test it out. That was easy. Oh, guess I spoke too soon. What are you feeding him? Let's just hope we don't run out of bags. Now let's try the hair clip. Hope you don't use it. Either way, we're covering it up. Hey, it works. And good thing the trash bin's right here. Well, that was fun. But now here's something for the cats. Look at that cat brush. And those bristles. And while we've got a cat here, why not try it out? Look at all that hair. Well, now it's a toupee. Up next, we're gonna try a foot. Oh, I guess just the sock. Add onto a brush. 
Just make sure all those bristles poke through. <laughs> Groomed twice in one day? <laughs> this cat knows how to live. Pull off the sock and the mess is gone. Pets don't do that whole don't play with your food thing. <laughs> Take this toy garden. Bury some treats. Plop in some carrots. Sort of reverse gardening, you know? Like, come on, Scoob! Put that snout to work! After all, what dog doesn't like to dig? Eh, carrots are really more of a rabbit thing. Take a TP roll, cover the bottom. Put a string through it and add a few more. Fill up with treats and give to your dog. The trick is to spin them around. It gets them on the floor, but not for long. Dogs gotta keep up their tongue exercises. Wow, look at all those suction cups. Stick it up and spread on something yummy for your pooch. While they're not looking, it's grooming time. Here's our backup plan. Take some plastic wrap. Wrap around your head and add the food. Now you and your dog can have some quality time. So why not squeeze in a manicure? Can't neglect your pet's dental care. And just in time, let's start with a brush. Now let's use the glove, but it could use some help. You just can't beat a good bristle. Add some doggy safe toothpaste. Now when you brush, really get in there. Ah, cats just seem to get the best toys. Just add a plume on top of this toy. Now, let your cat take it for a spin. So many ways you can play with it. This kitty's gonna sleep well tonight. But why not make a toy? Hey, watch out! Look, a feather. <laughs> this could come in handy. Just tape it to the end of your shoe. Why not both slippers while you're at it? Now you and your cat can play together. Throw in some catnip, and this is kitty luxury. Now for a puppy bumper. Start with the donut. After all, who doesn't love donuts? Open up and stick your pup inside. Now that fence is nothing to worry about. Now try a spoon. Just add to a harness. Like a cone of shame, but without the shame. Pets sometimes need a little space. You know, a little alone time. This cute little tent is just the thing. Of course, there's some owner assembly required. Come on, kitty, there's plenty of room inside. No wonder female cats are called queens. Let's see what we can make out of these old jeans. Plenty of leg room, but let's add some stuffing. Now fold it up into a makeshift lap. 
And it's your cat's rightful throne. It's time for some interactive dog toys. This bone's got some teeth. Add kibble. Let's hope its bark is worse than its bite. Now for the ultimate test, the bone or the chicken. Uh-huh, dogs and bones just go together. If you don't have one, just take a towel. Add some kibble in a pattern and fold it up. Nothing can hide from a dog's trusty sniffer. Unroll the pink carpet. It's snack time. Puppies are cute, but they usually don't come housebroken. <laughs> Devices like this should help. Just add a sheet. And your dog enjoys their own patch of lawn. But maybe a nice plastic bin is all you need. Just fill it up with some sand. Maybe some rocks and wood shavings, too. Now roll out a patch of artificial grass. Stick it in a corner and let your puppy enjoy needing to go. Cats just love a good light show. What are you waiting for? Fire the laser! If only the laser wasn't so hard to catch. Just like one of those cartoon mice. But maybe all we need is a hard hat. With a laser pen taped onto the front. Shake your head. Just don't get dizzy. I mean, you could just use the laser pen by hand. But come on, where's the fun in that? Because selfies aren't just for people. Seriously, social media is 99% pet photos. For this device, clip on a snack and a phone. Come on, time to get ready for your close-up. Let's send these headshots to Paw Patrol. <laughs> this frame might help too. Smear it with food. Once again, the food will catch your dog's attention. Zoom in, unless you want the food in the photo. Of course, it's hard to take a bad photo with such a cute model. Pet amazing stuff. Catch you next time. Well, it looks like we've just stumbled upon the mysterious city of boxes. Hey, sup, kitty? How's it purring? Yeah, these cats sure know how to party. Resting up for a big day of sleeping. Jeez, I wonder how they got those posters in there. Oh, look. There's a pair of little dog boots and... Balloons? Good. They look like a perfect fit. Perfect for a winter workout. Keeps those little paws mess free. And looks cute while doing it. Let's try the other one. Cut off the rim of a balloon and add it on. Look, after a walk, the balloon shoes are just as durable. Wow, a donut and a ladle. I wonder what they do. No, wait, that's not a real... Yeah. Well, if you can't eat it, wear it. And it protects your pup from getting lost. 
Now, how about the other one? A nice big ladle can work just as well. And the best part is, your dog can also help you serve soup. Huh, looks like more things for your pet to wear. But this time, we're going with cats. Make sure Mr. Kitty is nice and secure. Zip up that zipper. Wow. Now your cat can get lost in a good book as you hold it for them. Okay, our plan B is going to be wearing this shirt like a pouch. In you go. Now he's got a nice place to relax as you prepare him snacks. Two different brushes for your cat because cats deserve nice things. It even catches and releases all that excess fur. <laughs> now it's a wig. Oh, we're gonna add some special touches to this brush. Cool. It's like you made a little homespun scratching post. Oh, you gotta love that the cat does its own brushing. But all that hair? A licking mat? Oh, and it looks like hanging it up is a breeze. Wow, this should also make bath time a lot easier than usual. Maybe the plastic wrap will work too. Even if it goes on your head? Well, this should keep those aliens from reading your thoughts. Oh, good boy. Doggo stays still during a bath and a manicure. That's a whole spa day. A collar that lights up. Now that is a real fashion statement. This'll really step up your dog's laser tag game. And of course, making him easy to spot in the dark. Then again, we can always make this out of glow sticks. Just keep adding them on. And make sure that they fit, and hopefully last a while. And just like that, your pooch is ready for a rave. Our pets have spent a full day of pampering, so let's keep pampering them! It's like your cat has a bunch of tiny hands with tiny fingers all at his disposal. Toothbrushes will save on batteries, but the important thing is that the cat's happy. Good idea. But a cat can't spend all day being spoiled. It needs some playtime. What cute little mice. And cool, they come in a lot of colors. It makes you wish that real mice were this fun to play with. But as we all know, a cat's favorite toy is the box it came in. Especially when you get to play with it together. Aww. Oh, good. Now our canine friends get to join in on the fun. And with tasty treats. Come 
Come on, puppy. Put your nose to work and find those goodies. Seems like fun, but can we repeat this game with a towel? Just lay the kibble on the towel and then roll it up, like sushi. Seems to work just as well, but you're not sticking the toy in the laundry. Of course, after a treat, your dog needs something to wash it down with. Normally, you shouldn't put water in flowers. It's not nice. But this seems a lot nicer. We made ourselves a fountain. Cool. And would you look at that. He likes it. But can a water bottle be more than enough? Let's try it out. as long as it's secured to the wall. Either way, your puppy gets a nice drink. Yeah, petterific stuff. And thanks to our furry friends who helped out with this video. Catch you next time. Chicken day, everybody. Oh. Or whatever this is. Aw. Oh. Now Chicky can finally live up to his ancestors and look just adorable while doing it. <laughs> what a cute little nugget. In fact, it looks like all the animals are having a costume party today. Oh. A dog dryer. Let's hope today's toys are all about our furry friends. But first, Let's make sure it actually works. Thank goodness we already have a wet puppy. What a good girl. Staying calm while putting something on her. Let's hope she stays nice when the dryer turns on. Well, if you ever wanted a puppy puppy, here you go. Wow, it works. And while you're here, why don't you subscribe? Anything that makes balloon dogs is worth its weight in gold. A dog umbrella? Wait, how is she going to be able to hold that handle? Something tells me that chain is going to answer that. Right, the hook keeps the umbrella close by while you hold it. Good thing, too. It looks like a real storm out there. And there's even room for two. But the important thing is that the dog's okay. I guess this is a tool that you and your furry friend can share. Yeah, relax those smile muscles. Seriously, she smiles way too much. But let's try it out on your cat. Wow, he seems to like it. You've got yourself a real Cheshire cat here, don't you? I wonder if it works on pets other than cats. <laughs> let's see. This thing seems to be a real crowd pleaser, doesn't it? From this angle, this thing almost looks like a face. With this pouch, now you can always keep your best buddy close by. After all, why should kangaroos have all the fun? They've had it good for too long. Make sure to zip everything up. How on earth did she get that jacket on underneath? Aww, now you can take your dog on bike rides through the park? Keep them close while doing your laundry and other chores. And even introduce them to various babies. I mean, you probably can do that without a pouch, but where's the fun in that? That lady's just jealous that you have a cuter baby.
makes this cat toy more interactive than regular cat toys? Well, I guess we're gonna find out, aren't we? Oh, wow! Huh, it moves on its own! All the fun of playing with your cat. Without actually playing with your cat. Hmm. Or the fun. Yeah, in other words, some cats just have good taste. I wonder if we're gonna see anything for that baby chick. A duck muzzle? For your dog? I guess that's close enough. Okay, I see. This way, your pupper doesn't sneak snacks without you knowing. Especially any suspicious breadcrumbs. Yeah, that's right, I read Hansel and Gretel. And your puppy's already got a Halloween costume, too. Of course, dog care is a little more than just fun and games. Being a responsible pet owner can be real dirty work. In other words, honey, that's not a purse. Oh, well, get your bag ready. It's time for a walk. Oh, man. I don't want to know what you've been feeding this dog. Good idea. Use the tool. You don't know where this toy's been. And you can throw it away without getting your hands dirty. Hey, don't tell me what I can and can't use for a purse. Well, whatever this is, I'm having flashbacks to my pet hedgehog. Which is weird, considering I've never had a pet hedgehog. Aside from Sonic, that is. Either way, it's a paw cleaner, and it looks like you need to put it together. Complete with some water and a lid. Make it tight. And it looks like we already have some dirty paws to try it on. She's caught red-handed. Or maybe uh, brownish-gray-handed. Three, two, one. Success! Her paw is nice and clean. But don't forget, she's got four paws. Make sure to really get in there. And we've also got a nifty tool for cleaning those paw prints on the floor. A mop. This thing looks like a gadget from an old-timey sci-fi movie. Please tell me you're not feeding candies to your dog. Okay, good idea. Try it for yourself before testing it on your dog. I mean, I wouldn't want something happening to the dog. Good thing your dog's such a good girl. It's always time for a treat. Wow, that's a good catch. Did you do it a second time? Yes! Third time's a charm. Make that fourth. Good girl. No one cares about the fifth. That'd just be excessive. Yeah, a dog deserves a nice treat after a good workout. What's this? Oh, it's a brush for doggy bath time. Only now, we just need a magic tool to get your dog in the tub. Oh, that's clever. You even get to sneak in the soap. And every second counts once your puppy hits the water. Wow! Either you have the most well-behaved dog on Earth, or your pet fish is in serious need of a haircut. But seriously, how do you do it? Extra walks, double kibble? Don't forget the towel. We don't want her to shake herself dry. Although I'm surprised such a good girl doesn't towel herself off. If only everybody else was so easy to train. By the way, who gets to tell them that's the dogs? Hmm. What's next? A tennis ball? Oh, come on, that's an old classic. Now that's more like it. Adding a techno twist. Oh, uh, not that kind of techno. Either way, she seems to be having a good time. If only they made something that puts the balls in for you. Cool. With this next tool, we get to play Doggy Dentist. By the way, have you subscribed already? Come on, even your dog wants you to do that. Hey, bad girl, that's the dogs. I really need to keep an eye on her. That's better. And by the looks of things, or rather, the smell. We picked the right time to try it out. If only she'd open her mouth. Don't forget to hold her still. I should have spoke sooner. There's a reason they invented dental chews. Those toys were doggone awesome. Catch you next time.
Thursday again? Seems like we did this last week. Uh oh, the raccoons are back. Oh wait, that's no raccoon. Oh, what a cute little puppy. And look, no collar. Good thing you already got this pet backpack on you. Aquariums, they're not just for fish anymore. Huh, there's not a lot of leg room, is there? With a backpack like that, he's ready to go into space. Right out of the case, and he's already got muddy paws. Oh, right, you found him in the trash. Well, a nice warm bath should perk things up. Or don't dogs lick themselves clean? No, wait, that's cats. How cute, a dog brush. And it even has a little place to hold your soap. Rub-a-dub-dub. This must be a dog's favorite type of bath. The kind that doesn't use any water. But it works. Mm-hmm. Good thing. Otherwise, he'd be shaking the water off. And we wouldn't get this tender moment. Wow, he must be clean to be on the furniture clean. And now he gets his own wardrobe, too. Huh, a little big, but maybe he'll grow into it. Oh, wow, look at those nails. We need a manicure, hmm. stat. Sure, I've seen green nails before, but that was just paint. Why stop at the nails? Let's take care of that fur, too. Mm-hmm. Of course, the most important part of a beauty routine, canine or otherwise, is keeping clean. Cue the foam. Still, no true day of pampering is ever complete without some form of facial mask. Ooh. Hmm, what else can we do for our day of indulgence? Oh, good idea, some brushing. With a tongue? I repeat, isn't licking yourself clean more of a cat thing, not a dog thing, or a people thing? At least it seems easy to clean. Ah, now for a massage. Oh, and look, we've got a gadget for that too. First a nice neck rub, and then just work your way down the back. Hmm, does it work on people? Well, I guess you can after all. Though you should probably ask before using it. Mm -hmm. Time for dinner. Good, because I haven't eaten in like a whole hour. Mmm, a nice <laughs> salad. And the puppy gets... Mm, just some kibble. And even he doesn't look too appetized. Maybe hmm. it's all in the presentation. Ooh. Let's cut along the lines. It's just like coloring. And we want some bend to it, so add some tape. Now everything's got a nice shape. But still, we don't want to show off something that looks like cardboard. Gold-colored paint covers hmm. all sins. Ooh. And so do a bunch of fake jewels. Just don't advertise the fake bit. Man, and all this just to host the dog food bowl. Speaking of which, can we jazz up the food here too? Great! Good boy, look at him eating. All gone. Yes, it's true what they say. You reap what you sow. Wow. I wonder if that dog knows the goose that laid the golden egg. Anyone think they're related? Well, into the drawer. Oh, what's this? Oh, this hmm. looks like a collar. Huh? Just what our four-legged friend needs. But it needs something extra. Rhinestones are nice and all, but we want something personalized. And a photo will help show ownership. Well, looks like he's on a roll. Literally. He's gonna look so handsome with his new collar. Which means that it's the perfect time for a selfie. Give us a smile. Show us some teeth, but not in a show of dominance sort of way. Any other photo ideas? Let's make a fun border. 
Now pick a theme. Ah yes, the source of all happiness, money. Just don't use the real kind. Though by the looks of things, this new owner can probably afford to. Oh, he'll look so handsome in his portrait. Surrounded by Ooh. money. Just like Scrooge McDuck. Oh. After all this hmm. pampering, it's finally time for our puppy to relax. You better be planning a game of fetch, taking mm -hmm. his ball like that. Oh, wow, mm -hmm. a golden bone! Let's hope it's not real. I mean, you could chip a tooth. Hmm, seems like enough fun for today. It's time to get ready for bed. Or instead, time for another craft. Hmm, with this mold, we can make a bunch of little jewels of different sizes and colors. Put them all together, and we can make a fun mobile. Like for a baby crib. Just hang it up, and he's fast asleep. Wow, I thought he would need a bedtime story or two. Let's cut back to daytime. Time for a fun dress up. Ooh. And don't worry, just because dogs don't normally wear clothes doesn't mean they can't accessorize. <laughs> mm. Ah, adorable. Huh, he doesn't really seem to be a hat dog. Got anything else he'd like? How about hoodies? Well, the light up buttons have spoken. No, oh, but red is certainly his color. And it looks like he agrees. Just add some chains and some sunglasses, and he'll make Snoop Dogg look like Snoop Cat. Ooh. Let's see what other outfits he'd like to try. A white tuxedo? Does he look like James Bond? Hmm, maybe another color will do. Oh, he seems to prefer the more <laughs> classic black look. And it certainly seems to suit him. Oh, he's just so cute. What big eyes he's got. Time for another day of fun with your furry <laughs> friend. <laughs> what can be better than a puppy? Simple, more than hmm. one puppy. Ooh. And this one's so big, you just want to cuddle him up. And soon, there'll be even more puppies. In the meantime, our blushing bride wants some kibble. And maybe a steak or two. That was bow wow-tastic! Yeah, I went there. Catch you next time! Ah, the beach. Who wants to look for buried treasure? Oh, could there be gold in here? Oh, I guess not. Oh no! Your lollipop is all ruined! Hey, I said it's all ruined! Ah, eh, don't worry. Grandma's got just the thing to help. Your new little buddy will hold that sucker for you. Huh, that's funny. The news didn't say anything about rain today. Luckily, Granny has another little friend to help. For a bunch of bubbles, just press the button. See? That should give you a second wind. Wind? Rain? Wow, sure is some weird weather today. Looks like he's not running out of bubbles anytime soon. Ah, the great outdoors. Ah, where's the restroom? I guess everywhere's the restroom out here. But I guess we can at least spring for a seat. Ah, good start, but we should probably add a hole. Let's add a bag, too. Animals live here, too, you know. Now sit back, relax, and drop those...
tomatoes. <laughs> Just don't forget to bring some TP. You know, there's always time for some good dental hygiene. Careful, that toothpaste doesn't grow on trees. And this stuff is good to the last drop. Still, that's a pretty weird place to put the dispenser. <laughs> Dolly here will show you how much toothpaste you really need. <laughs> Someone's getting hungry. And that little girl, too. With this egg cooker, you can have breakfast anytime. Crack one of those bad boys inside. Oh, I thought I smelled sausages. Just add a stick and toss it in. Food always tastes better on a stick. Hey, be nice. Or Nana won't say where she hid the cookies. Let's hope this buried treasure is better than the last one. Oh, it's a ducky snowball maker. But we're on the beach. So let's make sand duckies instead. Don't worry. There's more where they came from. Enough for a whole ducky family. Even Nana can have a ducky. Or duckies. Just one sausage? Quick, check your hair again. Well, I guess you could just split it. And here's just the thing to help. Remove one dog and lay down another. And enjoy your bite-sized pieces. Mm, some jelly will go great on these waffles. Something tells me those bees don't want flowers. Run! Let's hope this mosquito tent works on more than just mosquitoes. Now you can enjoy your waffles in peace. I wouldn't open that if I were you. Oh no! Looks like this bee's been bulking up! Don't worry, he's about to meet a real queen bee. Come on, let's show this drone who's boss. Oh, a wrap! You know what would make it taste better? If it actually got inside your mouth. At least, try to keep everything in one place. Look, this seat even holds your drink for you. Brilliant. Don't worry, it catches anything that falls out. Let's just hope you don't drop it all over again. <sighs> Time for a good night's sleep under the stars. Nah, don't be scared. It's probably just a bear. Oh, wait. Nah, it's okay. Maybe it just wants porridge or honey. Well, Grandma's not waking up anytime soon. But maybe one of her gadgets can save us. Yes, a flashlight. And this one's a projector. Nothing's gonna bother us with a whole zoo in our corner. And just the thing before a good night's sleep. Where's a lifeguard when you need him? Or even better, quick, get grandma, hurry. Wow, this grabber can pick up all sorts of things. Especially ones you don't want to touch by hand. Or anything that's just out of reach. It's also great for those covert operations. Quick, eat it and hide the evidence. 
It's so bright. Can someone turn off the sun? Oh, wait. It's just Nana's grill. Don't worry. Just take some plastic. And mold it up into brand new sunglasses. Hey, keep your feet to yourself. This is so out of character for Nana. Oh, she got sand all over. Good thing we've brought a backup. The sides are like little hidden pockets. Four corners for all our stuff. And we're saving the best for last. It's a little cleaning and drying station before stepping on the towel. Now enjoy your day at the beach. Oh, it's windy and kind of chilly too. Don't worry, it's time for Nana's redemption arc. Yeah, that's a thing. And she's brought her handy dandy stretch film. Just sit back and pretend you're Cleopatra. Don't forget air holes or just stop the neck. Take out some scissors and cut along the middle. You've got a brand new jacket. And a hat. Sadly, it's time to go home. Let's grab all your things. Oh, you left your toy in the sand. Ouch! Just be happy it's just sand and not a pebble beach. You could put your shoes back on. Or turn this poppet toy into a new pair of flip-flops. Yeah, we like to have fun around here. Well, if the shoe fits, wear it. And grab that toy. And not just that mermaid. Mmm, <laughs> there's always time for ice cream. Oh, don't cry. There's more popsicles where that came from. All you need is juice and a few trusty molds. Just stick it in an ice-filled cooler. Wow, that was quick. Here, try this one. Just think of all the flavors you can whip up. Yeah, I'm starting to see the family resemblance. Okay, who keeps giving her coffee? Here, this hair provides plenty of shade. Right, so when are your parents picking you up? Beach amazing stuff. Catch you next time. You know, this beach has all kinds of hidden treasures. Don't worry, every doll without legs is just a mermaid in the making. <laughs> This resin will help keep everything all in one piece. And you cannot have glitter. It's glitter. <laughs> Let it dry and she's to live under the sea. <laughs> Put her down. Hey, your hand's a mess. <laughs> Look, she's a real girl. Fish, fish girl. Ooh, the Easter Bunny's at it again. <laughs> you know, this egg's just the right shape. For a brand new beach toy, <laughs> add sand. <laughs> and soon you'll have fresh, hot beach buns. Just be careful when you squeeze them. <laughs> Oh, duckies, the duck family. Oh no, good thing ducks like water. Don't cry, this should cheer you up. 
Now you can whip up a whole new flock. Just make sure to use wet sand. And, oh yeah, don't step on them. Who wants to tell him he can just make more? You know, this is swimsuit season. A little grooming wouldn't hurt. Some nanotape is just what we need. <laughs> Next up, let's give this tape a little air. <laughs> It'd be a shame to waste all that blue hair. <laughs> uh, draw a face and he's your new best friend. <laughs> Calm down. Just stand up. You're in the shallow end. Hey, you found a rock. Gotta love the bartering system. Ooh, let's hope she doesn't want her squishy toy back. You know, it's a party when they bring out the balloons. Better yet, they're your brand new floaties. What you waiting for? The water's fine. Hmm. Yeah, rocks aren't known for being too comfy. Hmm. Time to get crafty. Just take some tights and fill them with sand. Once it's nice and full, add some underwear. Now just relax and rest <laughs> your head. Ouch, that's hot. There's got to be some way your feet can beat the heat. Cat paws. <laughs> I was thinking flip-flops, but okay. <laughs> Careful, tippy toes now. Hmm, this might take a while. Still, art like that paw print tail takes work. <laughs> While we're at it, let's go for the whole cat look. <laughs> ah, the beach. Perfect place to watch videos. Maybe not. Can someone turn off that sun? Mm. Huh? Don't worry, Mr. Cat's got the next best thing. Mm. A cardboard box. Pets just can't get enough of them. And it'll give your phone some much needed shade. Now pass the popcorn. <laughs> There's a lot of fish in the sea, mm -hmm. so let's catch one. Ooh, even better, it's a new toy, a squish maker. Hmm? Should come in handy. Squishy toys don't last too long around here. Now blow it up so we can fill it up. Gummy worms, toys, glitter, whatever you want. Well, as long as it fits, like those ear pods. Some nice soda will wash it all down. Mm -hmm. Now it's time to get squishing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you probably shouldn't throw it. <laughs> Great, you know she's keeping it. <laughs> get in tight. Oh, you got a little something. Uh -huh. Wow, a shoelace. Yeah. How'd that get in there? <laughs> Either way, add to these tubes. <laughs> and give it a dip in something nice and soapy. <laughs> we can use it to make giant bubbles. After all, who said that bubbles can't be long? Ice cream on a hot day? This is why I always just get a milkshake. Next time, if you want to keep your hands clean, make a hole with your hand and fill it up with gypsum. Now it's a spare hand that hold the cone for you. 
leaving your hands mess free. <laughs> Always watch your step on the beach. Especially since that's not your towel. On the plus side, you found treasure. Huh? A pop tube! Let's add to our collection. You can never have too many pop tubes. You know, all these tubes might come in handy. <laughs> like bringing the ocean right to you. Sure, it's just a few steps away. A few steps too many. Okay, is anyone else starting to get dizzy? And look, you can give your feet a good wash. Just don't forget your other foot, too. <laughs> it sure is hot. Do we got any more ice cream? Wait, ice cream cones don't have propellers? But ice cream fans do. Ooh, I think you've got it set on high. Oops, it's a twister! Quick, someone grab Toto! Here, aim it against the ocean breeze. Ah, oh, now that's refreshing. Ooh, someone's been working on their tan. And with this sunscreen, you can embrace tan lines. Because it comes in cute little flower shapes. Just relax in the sun and wipe it off. Now, strike a pose. That pasta looks undercooked. Perfect for our next craft. Just stir in this paint until it's all nice and blue. Oh, don't cry. You would have chipped your tooth. Uh, put them in the sand. Add some ramen and rotini. Some shells, and it's a toy fish paradise. Ooh, I didn't know we'd be oh, whale watching. <laughs> Why, it's a cute little baby beluga. <laughs> Let's call him Squirt, it just fits him. Look at that, the drinks are on him. Hope you like your milk with a little extra crunch. <laughs> oh, hi, N. Find any buried treasure? Let's get sifting. Ah, it's A. Now that's what I call treasure. <laughs> but let's clean up all that sand. Maybe pluck some of those grubs. Now all he needs is a good scrubbing. Much better! Now you're ready for some beach time fun. Hmm, what could be better than sand ducks? When they've got even tinier ducks inside. Look, he's the right size for this slide. Quick, go again before it gets crowded. Told ya. Something this fun doesn't stay empty for long. Here, some letters will help us tell these ducks apart. Poor doll. Did your friends forget to dig you out? And did they take your legs too? Don't worry, one lower half coming up. Just need some glass beads and glue. We're gonna need some hair for this. Look, he's a centaur! After all, four legs are better than none. Ooh. 
chocolate spread. What could be better? Oh, cookies. And candy coating. And sprinkles. And maybe another cookie. Oh, I get it. It's a baby fish. Isn't he sweet? Watch your step. Eh, anyone want ketchup? Oh, look at your foot. It's a mess. Good thing we got our handy dandy foot bath. Ooh, soda and mints. Things are about to get bubbly. And don't forget, you have another foot. Almost done. Now that's one clean foot. Hey, watch your step. Ooh, what's that? A chip box? We can use it to make a new sand castle. Just sands sand. But it can have candy. It helps that they're already brick-shaped. What a pretty tower. And the best part, this top even comes with chips. Have you ever seen a beach tower? Oh, look, it's a tiny little octopus. Let's blow it up into a big, bad kraken. Wait until you see it in the water. Oh, I guess he's swimming away. It's okay, we've got a backup balloon. Why don't we fill it up with treasures? Wow, look at all that shiny stuff. Once it's all in, add some water. That should be enough. Tie it shut. And give your new stress ball a good squeeze. Hey, what's that? It's a water marker. What you waiting for? Let's try it out. Wow, look at all those different colors. For a real show, put it in some water. Don't worry, the color's still good. Dunk your hand in, the water's fine. Our mermaid's almost complete. Just a few more touches. Oh, she's alive! Alive! And she's keeping the seashells. Maybe we should clean her up for now. Ew. Where's an early bird when you need one? Let's finish it off with a little pimple popping. Wow, now she's really come to life. Come on, let's see the world. Ooh, we uh, need to get you some legs. But first, let's have fun with this new face mold. Good thing we brought gypsum to the beach. Once it's dry, start digging and clean it off. It could use some color. Let's get painting. Could use some blush. And pretty soon, you'll have your very own beach boyfriend. <laughs> Seashells, don't leave home without them. They're great molds when you want to give your face a rest. Now just fill it up with clear glue. And add glitter. Don't be stingy. Now let's add a secret photo inside. This would make a great necklace. 
You can even make it a locket. Careful, looks like we've got company. And this shark just might be out looking for a bite. Well, if you want to keep your fins wet, get shoveling. Wow, our tide pool is really coming together. Of course, we're gonna need some water. But first, lay down a mat to keep the sand down. Now add the water. It's kind of important. And not just because we need it to live. What you waiting for? Try it out! What's inside this shell? Aw, oh, she's so cute! Careful! Uh-oh, can you reach it? I think she might be there for a while. Well, if she's stuck... The Orbeez will at least keep her comfortable. Give her a few new friends. And then pour on some resin. Soon we'll have our own little mermaid habitat. Did you play in the algae again? Without me? Well, a manicure will fix you up. Take a paper square and draw a shape. Draw it a second time with a 3D pen. Just don't forget to fill in the outline. Now, just make one for each finger. Hey, hold on! The ocean's calling! Ice cream's great on a hot day! Wait, no! Now I'm worried about that cotton candy! Ooh, it's a mermaid tail! This must be the scales! Apparently, she'll only eat things with a face. And next time, ask for just the cone. An old friend wants to say hi. Ouch! Here's an idea. Take a balloon and deflate it around your hand. Now you've got a pair of safety gloves. What a cute little rainbow worm! Watch it squirm! Wow. Oh no! Quick, before the tide comes in! Well, bottle caps can be fun too, I guess. Besides, if you add them all up on a string, you can make a brand new rainbow worm. And this one comes with googly eyes. And a squirming we will go. Both on the beach and in the air. And look who's back, too! Got any old plastic bottles? Cut it up! until it looks like pieces of sea glass. Add some wire and clear glue on the edges. Now add glitter. And for that extra sparkle, add some gems on top too. Fake is fine as long as they shine. Now they're your brand new ear fins. Do you like water balloons? Try this! Fill a water bottle with seawater. 
pour it into a balloon for a new stress ball. Just can't beat freshly squeezed. Pretty flippy stuff. Catch you next time. Uh-oh. Someone needs to go while on the go. Good thing she's got these special pants. Always keep your pants on, because you might have to run. Maybe you should stick to your red riding hood. That's enough running for your life. Time for a snack break. Oh well, now I'm in the mood for poultry. Or maybe some eggs. Probably can't eat it raw. But we've come prepared. Just crack an egg inside. So that's where sausage comes from. Let's add a skewer in the middle and let it soak in the egg. Once it's good and cooked, well, bon appetit. Why not make a few? Oh, the sausages are in bloom. We need something to ditch all these bugs. Uh-oh, don't move. Ouch, oh, that's gotta hurt. But this pump should help. And it sucks the poison right out. Did you catch a stinger? What else does it work on? Let's try this pimple. Oh, it's like a geyser. Say goodbye to pus. Wow, it sure is hot. And what are you covered in? A shower is just the thing to help fix you up. This device should help. Water sold separately. It really comes in handy when you can't find a waterfall. <laughs> and the acoustics are great if you love singing in the shower. Wow, <laughs> wow the weather's kind of weird here. And now it's cold. Here's an idea. Take out some stretch film. And make like a spider and weave your own web. Start at the ground level by making a floor. Don't forget a few walls, and maybe a wall at the top. Just make sure you can still get in. Well, what are you waiting for? Climb on in. Now close the door and take a nap. You really can't beat a good nap. Ah, it's corn. Delicious, but not very digestible. Oh. Never know who might come by. So let's make ourselves a toilet. Start by cutting out a hole in the seat. Probably should add a bag and maybe a seat. Well, what are you waiting for? We might as well try it out. TP? Or should we go collect some leaves? What a nice spot to sit and relax. How'd you get grass stains on your socks? They really need a wash. Where's the closest river? Oh, even better. Bring the washing machine to us. Just add your dirty laundry to the bag and add water. Now roll up the bag and get shaking. Come on, shake your group thing. Get things moving. Put those years of bongo practice to good use. Okay, I think the clothes are done with their rinse cycle. Now it's time to hang them up to dry. It's always great when Mother Nature provides. But Mama Nature ain't paying your dentist bills. Uh, your toothbrush doesn't look so good. It's okay. We just need the bristles. And a syringe. 
Now fill that syringe up with toothpaste. Just push and start brushing away. Much better. Just look at those curly whites. Probably should wipe the rest of your mouth too. With all this trekking, we might as well take another nap. Oh, maybe giant rocks don't make great mattresses. It's a good thing we brought a bed with us. Uh, sort of. It's an inflatable bed. Now get some air. Come on, it's free. Now roll up the ends and close it up tight. All that running was busy work. Time to relax. Time for a lunch break. What do we have? Oh, this bread seen better days. Well, the answer is simple. Time to go fishing. Just add the bread as bait inside this net. I'm sure the fish will appreciate a break from worms. Hey, I think we caught something. Go ahead, reel it in. Yeah, we caught wow. one. Make that a few. Mm -hmm. We'll be eating good tonight. Hey, careful. There's a big puddle coming up. Yeah, probably shouldn't wear white shoes on hikes. Still, it's important to keep any shoe dry. And you just can't beat being pretty in pink. Now this mud puddle is no problem. And you can stay dry in all this water. <laughs> oh no! We're out of water! Oh, I can do so much laundry! Huh? Well, there's water everywhere, just not a drop to drink. Yay! Seriously, you don't want to know Ew. what fish do in here. Hmm. But maybe we can clean it up. Collect some water. Rip off a piece of cloth, like from your shirt. Mm -hmm. Add it between a filled and empty cup. Soon, clean water will drip down. And you'll have a safe, refreshing drink. Wow. Mm -hmm. <gasps> uh -huh. Oh no! Oh. Are you all right? That was a nasty fall. Oh. And that looks like a nasty <gasps> cut on your arm. We're out of band-aids, but this tampon might help. Just cover the cut. You can even tie it around your arm. And uh -huh. that takes care of that. Hey, what's that smell? I Ugh. guess those tampons are pretty versatile. Now she can't <laughs> smell a thing. This just isn't her day. What happened? Eh? Great, another monkey party I wasn't invited to. Well, when life gives you bananas, slice them open and add some chocolate. Let's add some marshmallows too. A few crumbs can help add a nice crunch. But nothing tops sprinkles, in both senses of the word. It's time to get things cooking. Wrap it in some tin foil. And let it cook over a flame. Well, what are you waiting for? Besides cooling off. Wow! Now grab your spoon and dig in. Oh, it's all nice and gooey. And it's a great source of potassium. Okay, that's enough outside for today. 
Oh, good. It's civilization! We're saved! <laughs> well, it can be nice to see a familiar face. Yeah. Usually. Camptacular oh. stuff. Catch oh. you next time.